Uh-huh. Hold on, I'm looking at this car. I don't know what it's doing. Good morning guys, today is Monday, May 2nd. It's about 5.45 in the morning. I hope you guys had a good weekend. I uh, got up at four this morning to get to this call time at six o'clock here at the Nike headquarters. All those rehearsal dates that we were doing last week and in my vlog, these are all for the show that's actually today. Did I lock my car? I like to park here and then boost in the campus because it just saves so much time because the campus is always so backed up with cars trying to pull out and just the parking garage and everything. So I like to park in this parking lot about a half mile away. Uh, gonna be a pretty busy day. We have a few more Nike shows later today as well in a totally different category. So I'm gonna take you guys along the way. I hope you guys enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. I'm shining on my own Is money got it on my own Got a couple hundred thousand in a hair tie Homie, I just had to get my bread right Locked up in Made it on time Come in, I spot, I spot Skog's getting in on some, on some Nike breakfast here I cooked this morning too. Yeah, he already ate this morning and it's not even 6 o'clock yet and he's on meal number two. <laughs> and I ate. Amy. Well, we had Chipotle and then I went and had Chevy's. Like, like, <laughs> Mexican. I don't need carbs. Hey guys, that all the show has been seen. Look who it is. It's like 10 in the morning right now. Finished up with the first show of the day. Been up for, what, five and a half hours? Yeah, we've been up for five hours already. It's crazy. And now we're boosting back to the cars. We're probably gonna go to Starbucks or something for like an hour and a half until the other show starts. You can't leave me behind. Oh, it's that time. Oh, oh, it's that time. Oh, oh, it's a curve. Are we still doing it? No, tomorrow? we're just doing rehearsals. Yeah, we still, and then the actual things tomorrow. Oh, uh, okay. So here's what's going on. So today we were supposed to do rehearsals and the show, but the people, or the flight got canceled or something for the people that are actually doing the show. So today's just rehearsal. Just one car. And tomorrow is the actual show. So we have actually have something going on tomorrow as well. But yeah, you want to just drive in one? Yeah. All right, cool. Twelve fifty right now. We finished up with the rehearsals. We're about to eat meal number two. I'm eating. That's been sitting in the sun. No, it hasn't. No, it, it's been in. The... No, no way. <laughs> That's been out of the fridge for like ten hours today. It is currently four thirty-five in the afternoon. I took a hour and a half nap once I got home. I actually showered, got all the gel out of my hair, and took a nap from like. I think it was like 2 to 3.30, I believe. And now I'm responding to some emails. I'm actually working on a client's abdominal routine right now. And then later tonight, I'm gonna meet Austin at the gym. I'm just grinding through all this work right now, trying to get as much done as possible. So then once I'm home, later tonight after the gym, I can just relax and go to bed because tomorrow morning, I have to be up at... So this show got moved to tomorrow morning, so I have to be up at six tomorrow morning. So that's gonna be another night of very little sleep. And then Wednesday, the same thing. I have to get up at seven for this show. And then Thursday, potentially going to LA with a flight departing at 7, 10 in the morning. It doesn't look like I'm gonna be getting much sleep this week as well. Last week, I barely got any sleep either, just from all the hours at Nike. I think I worked over 30 something hours at Nike and then putting in anywhere from 20 to 30 hours on my client plans, emails, and everything like that. So it's been a pretty exhausting week. Very happy though, I love this stuff. I love 
all this. I love this work. I love the Nike work. I love everything. So I'm very happy for it. So hopefully at some point this week I'll be able to catch up on some sleep and relax a little bit. But right now I'm just grinding through it, guys, and I'm enjoying it. On my way to the gym now, Austin and I are actually meeting at Chipotle near the gym at 8 o'clock. It's 7.47 right now, so I decided to stop at my P.O. box because one of my subscribers, he's actually sent me something before. He's a really, really nice guy and a good friend of mine. He actually told me he sent me some, I believe these are like cookies. So I went and stopped there and sure enough the box was there. I was actually surprised because I thought that they were going to have to keep it back there because my P.O. box wasn't big enough. I'm going to open it for you guys right now. <sighs> These will be good for full days of eating. Austin's gonna freaking love these things. Hey Nick, thanks for everything. Hope you like the samples. I have one more package coming to you as well. I will see you later, your brother, Fadi. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. I appreciate the note. I appreciate these cookies. There's like six boxes in there. Holy crap. 7.58 right now. I was supposed to meet Austin at Chipotle at 8 o'clock. He just texted me saying he's just about to get home, so it's probably going to be another 15 to 20 minutes. I figured I'd talk to you guys a little bit while I'm sitting in the parking lot waiting for him. So I want to talk about two things. One of them is my calorie update and the second one is my workout split update. I've been taking in 4,300 calories. The past few days, give or take, I'd say more closer to like 4,400, 4,500 calories. Just because I've been switching in the last, I think five days straight, I've been switching in Chipotle with one of my meals. Because of how busy I've been at Nike, it's just so much easier to switch in Chipotle so I don't have to cook a meal. So I've been doing that. Once Nike settles down a little bit this week, I'm gonna go back onto the diet, be strict on it, see how 4,300 calories works, and I'll let you guys know on my weigh-ins and everything like that. But as of this morning, I think I weighed in at like 193.2 pounds. But I woke up at 4 in the morning and I went to bed at like 11.30 at night and had a massive meal. So that weigh-in wasn't very accurate. Now the second thing I want to talk about was my workout split change. So what I'm going to do, instead of a 5 day on, 1 day off, adding another rest day in. And it's kind of like a 7 day split. So I'll be doing a rest day twice a week and then work out 5 days a week. This guy just gave me like the weirdest stare for about 15 seconds when I was talking to my camera. I wonder if I'll hook it up with a burrito. He's struggling a bit. Oh, there he goes. What a champ. All right, I figured while I'm waiting for him, I'm not really doing anything else, so I might as well get a time lapse of the sky because it's actually pretty cool right now. So I'm gonna get a time lapse to you guys right now. And I hope you enjoy it. When I'm showing up, all these labels calling, yeah, they wanna sign me. We got our bowls, the usual. He got double chicken, I got single chicken, double rice, and this is gonna be the pre-workout meal. It's kind of starting to get dark here. It's like eight. 31 to be exact. What is up guys? Hope you guys are having a good day or morning. Uh, I'm going to be talking over this back and arm workout that Austin and I had the other day. It is currently Wednesday night, 7.10 in the evening. I have a few more hours until I head off to bed and then tomorrow morning I'm headed off to LA. I think I have to get up at like 4.30 to catch the 7 o'clock flight. I'm only going to be there for a weekend. I actually have a few business meetings set up on Friday, but you guys know Courtney is, is in LA, so I didn't want to spend some time with her. So I'm going to stay the weekend and return Monday morning back home because I have actually a Nike show Monday afternoon. So I can't stay too long in LA, unfortunately. But I am actually going to try to surprise Courtney. She thinks that I have a photo shoot here Thursday and Friday this week. So she thinks I'm not coming to LA anymore. But I am going to fly in, Uber to her house, and surprise her. Probably have her open up a Snapchat or something of me outside. So that's the other thing I wanted to talk about. This video is going to be uploaded a little bit later than usual just because I don't want her to watch this video before I get there. So I'm probably going to upload this video like 9, 9.30 uh, Pacific time. So sorry about that, but I don't want to ruin the surprise. But this week has been insane. Insanely busy. I've gotten very little sleep, but I still have a ton of energy. These workouts have been amazing. I don't know if it's because I have Austin now as a workout partner to kind of push me and keep me motivated throughout the workouts, but it's been feeling really good. Uh, I actually did legs yesterday and I was hitting numbers that I was doing at my peak of 200 pounds last year. So I can see the progression in all my weights and all my movements going up, which is awesome. I'm slowly seeing the scale going up. Unfortunately, right now I'm not seeing a lot of size. Maybe I'm just really delusional, but I'm not seeing a lot 
of actual size on my body right now, but I'm not too worried about it. I know once I get up in the numbers, I'll start to see really good growth in my body. At least I hope so. And here's a little posing update to finish the workout, guys. I know I do need a ton of work on my arms, especially my biceps. So I am putting in two days a week on that. Um, feeling really good about it, so hopefully they'll grow. I'm trying to get these things to 16 and a half by the end of this bulk, which is going to be quite a mission. Anyways, guys, enjoy the rest of the video, and I'll see you soon. Finished the workout. It's like 11.15 right now. We were there for like two and a half hours. Arms, back, a little bit of cardio. He did a little bit of abs. But I'm going to wrap up this video now. I'm not going to do anything for the rest of the night. We have to get up at 6 o'clock tomorrow morning, so we're not going to get much sleep at all again. So I'm going to end the video here, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed the workout. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys enjoyed him. We'll see you guys soon.